हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू सेशन थ्री ऑफ चैप्टर थ्री बर्थडे गिफ्ट बोर्ड इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट डिफरेंट सीजन्स थ्रू सम टेक्सचुअल एक्सरसाइजेस सो लेट्स बिगिन दिस इज एक्टिविटी नंबर सेवन इन योर टेक्स्ट बुक पेज ट्वेंटी फोर Look at the pictures and write the names of seasons under each picture. What do you like to do in these seasons? Write it in the box. That means here are three pictures of different seasons are given and you have to identify and write a few lines about each season. And after that you have to answer this question. Which season do you like the most and why? Let's see each picture one by one. The first picture is of winter season. Let's understand what can we write about winter season. Number 1, I enjoy wearing my favorite sweater. I enjoy doing exercise in the morning. I enjoy playing in the garden i enjoy drinking hot milk i enjoy eating fresh fruits and vegetables next picture is of summer season let's read what can we write about summer season number 1 i enjoy eating ice cream 2 i enjoy going for a walk in the evening 3 i enjoy my summer vacation 4 i like to go for a ride on my bicycle in the evening 5 i enjoy eating mangoes children you can make your own sentences like this the third picture is of monsoon season we can write the following sentences Number 1 I enjoy wearing my raincoat. Number 2 I enjoy playing in the rain. 3 I enjoy sailing paper boats. 4 I enjoy eating sweet corns. 5 I enjoy the dance of the peacock. Now as I discussed earlier we have to answer the question which season do you like the most and why children here your answer can be different than mine but the answer given here will help you to make your own answer so let's read i like the rainy season the most i love to play in the rain when it rains i go out and sing and dance in the rain I enjoy sailing paper boats with my friends. Now, moving further, here is activity number 10 given in your textbook. This is a small poem for your reading practice. So let's read. Rain, rain, rain. It's raining today. I hear the rain pitter patter. On the roof, I love to play in rain. and that with my boat i love the rain here the words pitter patter is a sound that rain makes and if you remember children we have discussed different sounds in the previous sessions next is creating jingles now let's understand what is a jingle a jingle is a short slogan a tune a small song a rhyme or a catchy line which can be easily remembered now children we all watch tv and along with tv programs we also watch many advertisements if you notice each advertisement has some catchy lines or a song that we remember very easily they are called jingles now let's see some of the famous advertising jingles for mcdonald's it is i am loving it for kitkat the catchy line is 
किट कैट ब्रेक बनता है फॉर डेरी मिल्क इफ यू रिमेंबर द कैची लाइन इज कुछ मीठा हो जाए नाउ आई एम श्योर यू ऑल हैव अंडरस्टूड वॉट आर जिंगल्स नाउ कमिंग बैक टू अवर टेक्सट बुक एक्टिविटी हियर वन जिंगल इज गिवन लेट्स रीड इफ आई वर द रेन आई वुड मेक पडल्स ड्रॉपिंग फ्रॉम द हाई स्काई लाइक दिस now we have to make two more jingles of the things shown here next you have been given a picture of an umbrella so let's see what we can say if i were an umbrella i would sing and dance with little children in the rain children you can make your own jingles like this The next picture is of a rainbow. Now let's see what we can write. If I were a rainbow, I would touch the earth and make everything very very colorful. Now children, you can make your own catchy lines or rhymes too. Next is writing an essay. That means you have to write a few lines on the topic my favorite season. Let's read. My favorite season is monsoon. I love the rainy season because it makes the trees and plants look beautiful. I like to play in the rain with my friends. We make paper boats and sail them in puddles. Sometimes we jump in the puddles and splash water on one another. When the rain stops I enjoy watching the rainbow in the sky So students make a notice that this essay writing is not given in your textbook but it is for your extra practice you have to write this in your notebook I hope you have understood chapter 3 thoroughly let us end our today's session here Bye for now. Thank you. So students, this is the end of the chapter. I hope this session has helped you to recall the chapter very well. For rest of the part, you can read the revision notes sent to you. Thank you.